Meanwhile, Tanzania's football giants Simba will face South Africa's Kaiser Chiefs in their first leg of the CAF Champions League quarterfinals on May the 15th in Johannesburg. The second leg is scheduled to be played one week later in Dar es Salaam. CGTN's Daniel Kijo has more on the Dar Giants who are billed as the dark horses of the tournament. Tanzania's biggest football club, Simba, is busy preparing for its biggest test yet. The team will face Kaiser Chiefs, one of South Africa's most accomplished teams. The team's showdown for CAF Champions League's quarterfinal is set for May 15th. For a long time, Tanzanian clubs have not performed on the international scale. So if Simba can represent the Tanzanian flag, let it be. It's our time now. We needed a team like Simba. Let's hope this serves as motivation for other teams like Yanga and Azam. This will be the first time these two teams meet in the African Champions League competition. Simba's campaign so far has been impressive. It finished at the top in Group A with 13 points from five matches and had managed to win four matches and draw only once against El Merak of Sudan in Khartoum. However, the road to Champion League title gets even harder. According to the draw, if Simba SC makes it past Kaiser Chiefs, they will meet the winners of Wydad AC and MS Alger in the semi-finals. Simba fans are confident that their team can make it all the way to the top and win Africa's most prestigious title, the CAF Champions League Cup. We will just cruise past them. It's an easy win. If we were able to play against teams like Al Ahly, AS Vita, they will be even easier. We will cruise to the semi-finals, then this time all the way to the finals. The quality of football Simba are playing is superb. Their gameplay is no different from Africa's big teams. The CAF Champions League final is slated for July 17th at a neutral venue yet to be named. Daniel Kijo, CGTN, Dar es Salaam.